Hello everyone and welcome to this virtual tour of the postgraduate study at the School of Biochemistry and Immunology at Trinity College Dublin. My name is Michael Carty and I'm Assistant Professor of Immunology uh, within the school. So the School of Biochemistry and Immunology is housed in the Trinity Biomedical Sciences Institute, which is a fantastic new and modern building uh, on Pier Street. So the mission of the school then is to discover the fundamental mechanisms that underlie human diseases. So we are concerned with how things work during health, what goes wrong during disease, and crucially, how we can fix these diseases with new therapies. So this is the fundamental mission of the school. So the mission of the school is to understand disease, and we look at a number of different areas, such as metabolism, immunology, cancer, neurodegeneration, and structural biology. So there are a number of postgraduate courses within the School of Biochemistry and Immunology here at Trinity College Dublin, and these include PhD programmes and two taught programmes, which are the MSc in Immunology and the MSc in Immunotherapeutics. And both of these master's programmes are one-year programmes. So the PhD programmes typically are, are four-year programmes, and there are a number of research themes within the area of biochemistry, and these include structural biology, transfer RNA biology, neurochemistry, systems biology, cancer biology, molecular parasitology, apoptosis, and other mechanisms of cell death, energy transduction, and mitochondria biology, and drug discovery. Within immunology, there are, a number, there are also a number of research themes, and these include immunoregulation, cell signaling and immunity, cell signaling and immunity and inflammation, immunoparasitology, vaccine adjuvant research, innate immunity and inflammation, and viral subversion of immunity, which is a very hot topic at the moment, given the SARS-CoV-2 virus, which is very adept at hiding from and evading the host immune system to establish infection, which is causing this current pandemic, and host pathogen interaction studies, which concern the interaction between bacteria and the human host. So the PhD programmes then, which is typically four years, as I said, we currently have 77 PhD students within the school, and many of these students uh, come from various locations across the globe. So moving on to the MSc in Immunology, there are three main aspects to it. And the first one is the taught component, which includes lectures and small group tutorials. The second part is practical classes where the students will learn key methodologies that underpin life sciences, such as the polymerase chain reaction used to detect, for example, the genome of the SARS-CoV-2 virus as a diagnostic tool, um, STS page, uh, flow cytometry, and a range of other uh, key techniques used in the area of immunology. Another key feature of the Masters in Immunology is that there is a 12-week placement with an individual principal investigator or team leader where original scientific research will be conducted by the student, giving the student the opportunity to generate original scientific data and contribute to the field of study, which is very exciting for the students. So just a bit, little bit more detail on the MSc in Immunology. So there are a number of different modules, and the first one is basic immunology, immunological technologies, which is a practical component, the practical classes, uh, communicating science and critical analysis, tumor immunology, which is a, a huge area and a very exciting area at the moment, immunogenetics, microbe detection and evasion, clinical immunology, global infectious diseases, which include HIV and TB, among others. And then 
lastly, we have an immunotherapeutics and product development module, which is where we ask the students to develop a novel drug uh, targeting the immune system, which might be, might be used to treat a particular disease. We ask the students to raise finance, and it's a Dragon's Den type situation, uh, which is a lot of fun and really is very interesting. And great ideas every year are brought forward by the students. So together, then we have the research project, which is a 30 ECTS module. Uh, together, uh, making up a 90 ECTS um, taught masters in immunology. So what we think you will love about the MSc in immunology at Trinity College Dublin is taught by international leaders within the field, the opportunity to gain practical laboratory skills by the students, and the 12 week research project gives the students an ideal opportunity to generate novel scientific findings. So moving on then to the MSc in, immunothera in immunotherapeutics, it was launched in 2019 to support the growing immunotherapeutic and biopharma industry in Ireland and internationally, and to provide high quality graduates uh, to support the growth of this important area within the economy. And it pro provides a six month uh, research placement uh, in an in industry relevant uh, to, the, to the field. So just a little bit more detail on the modules covered within the MSc in Immunotherapeutics, uh, Fundamental Immunology, Advanced Technologies, which are the technologies used in, in DNA and protein engineering, Immunotherapeutics, um, how current Immunotherapeutics are designed, which uh, include the PD-1 inhibitor, Immunotherapy used in cancer treatment, Drug Discovery, Research in Action, which is a science communication module, bioinformatics and statistics, and bioprocess training, where we teach the students how biotherapeutic molecules are, are manufactured, and entrepreneurial action then, where we enhance the business acumen of our students. Then there is the six month industry placement, that's 30 CTSs, um, making up a 90 ECTS uh, MSc in immunotherapeutics. So the placement um, can be with any number of world leading companies, which include Pfizer, familiar to many people, as the, the, they make the a, one of the vaccines against um, SARS-CoV-2, and Sanofi and Genzyme MSD, uh, among a host of others. So there are a number of reasons why we think you will love the MSc in Immunotherapeutics at Trinity College Dublin. It is taught by international leaders in the field. Um, the opportunity to, by students to gain expertise in the design of drug therapies that target the immune system. And the six month industry placement gives, gives the students real world industry experience and real insight into the sector. So one question you might be asking is, where do MSc in Immunology and MSc in Immunotherapeutics graduates go on to next once the programme has been completed? Well, there are a number of different areas. Uh, many go on to complete PhD studies. Some students go on to study medicine. Uh, some students go on to take up roles as medical laboratory scientists within hospitals. Other students go into the, to the pharma industry to take up various roles. Increasingly, we see our graduates going into science communication. And the global nature of our graduates really has enhanced the reputation of these two master's programs and um, in increased the, the visibility of these two programs, which the students really enjoy and enhance their career prospects. So we have a number of facilities in our school that allow us um, fulfill our mission. This includes transgenics, in more facilities, metabolomics, electromicroscope, X-ray crystallography, gene analysis, and bioinformatics. So we have a fantastic flow cytometry facility within the school to examine different cellular characteristics and populations within biological samples. We have an excellent micro microscopy and imaging center to allow the generation of these fantastic images 
that tell a real story uh, about processes within the cells, within both immune cells and in cells of the a, a central nervous system in this particular case. We have a fantastic electron microscopy suite also and in more facilities as well. Uh, our school includes leading international scientists, uh, including Professor Luke O'Neill, Professor Tino Farrelly, and Professor Kingston Mills. And many of you will have seen e each of these three international scientists contribute um, importantly to, to the discussion currently on COVID-19. So there are publications from the School of Biochemistry and Immunology um, are world leading, such as this paper published by Professor Luke O'Neill's group that appeared in Nature recently. And we find the publications from the School of Biochemistry and Immunology, uh, many are in the top 1% and many of the papers are in the top 10% of most cited papers within the discipline of immunology. We have an annual research day, um, which is a lot of fun. This particular picture taken from a pre-COVID pre era. Uh, and so it's the opportunity for students to share uh, re results with colleagues and other students. Um, we have many social activities. Once again, this photograph was taken in the era pre-COVID. And hopefully we'll, we can return to, to these activities, which are very important. The school has many success stories. Uh, this is one recent one where a company founded by Professor Luke O'Neill called Inflazome was sold to Roche for 380 million euro. So a fantastic success story speaks so highly of, of the work that is, that is done within the School of Biochemistry and Immunology and the potential of some of the findings uh, of the company Inflazome, uh, which will have a big impact on um, the treatment of inflammatory diseases. Thanks very much for your attention. And if you would like further information on the courses offered by our school, please visit the website shown on this slide. Thank you.